to think about putting one down on the ground here. Two on, one out. They lead at second and third. Harris sets, and he throws, and Fields takes outside for ball one. Well, the Paw Sox don't have a quote-unquote closer, but he was the one early in the season who got the first save opportunity. We talked about the game against Lehigh Sunday, and it was a one-run game. So just a, a slim margin for error, and he was perfect. Really impressive stuff. The 1-0 pitch is outside. Has 96 miles an hour. Fastball and a splitter for Williams. He himself moved from the Dominican Republic to New York in his high school years. He wanted to immediately return home. His dad told him, stick with it, hang in. And it has paid major dividends. To a pitch, swing and a miss. 95 mile an hour fastball. And it's two and one. And he's the only one who's gone out on the mound tonight with short sleeves on. All that time in New York toughened him up. Yes. Red Sox lead 4 0. Here, the Pot Sox 3 0 with one out, but runners at second and third for Buffalo. I mean, it's really cold. From the stretch, the 2 1. Beauty. On the outside corner, 96. And it's 2 and 2. It's not often in a baseball game you see the old football look where every time somebody on the field takes a breath, they, you see the puff of air come out of their mouth. Yep. Always a feature in the great John Facenda narrated NFL films. The big uglies up front. Steam coming out of their face masks. Two and two. The pitch. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. Elevated fastball. See ya. Up at the letters and Fields could not lay off. That is the power. Williams Harris on full display. A big second out. And here's John Birdie. And we've seen it now for two seasons. That's how you attack Roman Fields. Go up with hard stuff. Can't get around on that hard one. Big strikeout. In a spot where if Roman had just put the ball on the ground, Buffalo would have gotten a run. Yep. Paw Sox were absolutely conceding one there. Now they back up even further. Two on, two out. Birdies look good at the plate, and he takes a strike, 96 on the inside corner, 0-1. He struck out Birdie, but he also hit an absolute bullet to center field that was caught by Rusne Castillo. Came with runners at first and third back in the fifth. 3-0 Pawtucket, two outs in the seventh. He sets, he throws, and it's fouled off. First base side out of play as it is. Let's take 10 seconds for station ID on the Paw Sox radio network. Will Fleming, Josh Maurer, Paige Corey back in the studios at HJJ doing a great job on the board here at McCoy. An 0-2 count from Jerez to Birdie. Pitch. Swing and a ground ball to short. Miller has it. He throws to first just in time. Wow. Bang, bang, play. Birdie hustling down the line. He is gone, and the inning is over. Williams Harris continuing to earn a trusted role out of a big time.